What is the area of the triangular region ABC above? Before we proceed, notice what we can and can't tell from the diagram. We can tell that the angle at D is a 90 degree angle. That's been marked. We can tell that this angle is, has X degrees. We don't know what X is. We don't know for sure whether we're dealing with an isosceles triangle or not. In other words, AB is approximately equal to the length of BC, and it may be exactly equal, but we're not sure. They could be slightly off. So in other words, this triangle is either exactly, equal, exactly isosceles or something kind of close to isosceles. That might be an important distinction. So statement number one tells us the product of BD times AC equals 20. Well, BD, this length right here, BD, that's an altitude. By definition, an altitude is a line that goes from a vertex and is perpendicular to the base. And of course, the length of the altitude is a height. Well, AC, this distance here, that's a base. So base times height equals 20. Well, divide that by 2, 1 half base times height equals 10. So that information by itself is sufficient to answer the question, to allow us to find the area of the triangle. Statement number two tells us that x equals 45 degrees. Well, the problem with statement number two by itself, we have no information about length whatsoever. And because we don't know even whether it is a perfect isosceles triangle or not, we have no guarantee about that, we don't even know angle C. In other words, angle C is going to be something close to 45 degrees, but we have no guarantee that it's going to exactly equal 45 degrees. And so, unfortunately, we have no way to, to calculate anything just given one angle. And so this statement by itself is insufficient. One is sufficient, two is insufficient, answer choice A.